and gone shows in this episode that he does not fuck around. This episode of Hunter Hunter, a lot of stuff really went down. Like at the start, you get to see, you know, Cheeto, you know, versus like Knuckle and Morel. That was actually pretty cool. Like I said, it's the same thing with Hunter. All the good bits go by like so quickly. It's, it's like seeing like how much they're fucking him up. Like even Knuckle and Morel just getting used to his speed and like literally like a minute or so like i was like how strong are these guys like with their nervousness and just you know eyes eye and just combat it why it shows that how much of the veteran they are that they get used to their opponents so quickly i really like that you know that especially as well the animation for like this fight part was gorgeous it looked absolutely great at this part and like knowing that freaking knuckle inflicted the good old fucking uh his net ability on him to like um sort of slow him down but saying that it doesn't reactivate after a certain range so that's his weakness that it doesn't uh, stay permanently so he's pretty much just nullified pretty much um Cheeto really using a lot of his nen anymore which was pretty cool and then seeing when gone and killua when like um morel uh rest of them invited him to show over kite and they took away his net and you see just how fucked he up uh fucked up he is like this guy's and just gone is just trying to talk to him and getting close to him. He's getting punched. And he's like, I'm going to get you back, Kai. Like he's holding him. And just seeing that he was like there, like crying. It's, 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 that was so emotional, actually. Just seeing that. Just And then you actually see the net ability that is controlling him, which is the the puppet thing from Nefropito. And one bit really showed how much Gon really wants to fuck up Nefropito is when Morel says, I still don't trust your mindset. Since like, even in, like when they were traveling with him to NGO, like they still had a lot of doubts in the mind, like whether or not Gon is really prepared going back there. And he said, I want to hit you. Like I was the intention that I was Kite's killer. And he said, do you really want me to do that? And he looked like you, like his face, that fucking face. He looked like he was uh, just psychopathic. Like he, and he even said, I was going to kill you then. And I was like, shit. Just like fucking shit then. Like, this kid don't fuck around. And then seeing that they're using this ability as well to the night, it's like they got that fat guy that used to control part of the NGL um, using him and saying, you know, I'm inviting all these people to my capital and saying that, they, you know, 99 of those people are going to get slaughtered. That was like, yo, that's some crazy shit. Overall, like a lot of shit went down in this episode, and I really thoroughly enjoyed it. Um, yeah, there's nothing really too much else to talk about in this episode because I feel like I got everything out of there. Definitely got to give it an eight out of ten for this week. I really thoroughly enjoyed it, and just the whole team setup for like next week, saying like Gon and Killua are gonna take um Nefropito, Knuckle and Shoot are gonna take on um. I believe it's the um, butterfly guy, and then um, Morel and the other one is going to, and Palm is going to take on the big guy Melithium or something. I I can't remember. I can't remember those two names. And then uh, Nitro is going to take on the um, king himself. So overall, it's a very good episode. I give it an eight out of ten. But let me know what you guys think in the comment section below for this episode of Hunter Hunter. But it's all for me, so as always, remember, Strat Lap Vanda, sign out, and I'll see you next time, people.